Let's talk about neonatal red flags. There are four major areas you need to watch. Respiratory distress, effects of gestational diabetes, jaundice, and birth injuries. First up, respiratory issues. Think respiratory distress syndrome or RDS in preemies. Immature lungs, not enough surfactant, collapsed alveoli. Then there's transient tachypnea of the newborn or TTN. Fast breathing from leftover lung fluid leading to ineffective gas exchange. Breathing faster for more oxygen. And meconium aspiration syndrome or MAS, where meconium blocks airways and enters the lung, putting the newborn at risk for infection. Persistent pulmonary hypertension of the newborn or PPHN. That's when fetal circulation doesn't switch over, causing dangerously low oxygen levels. Now, babies born to diabetic moms, they're at risk for hypoglycemia, congenital defects, and macrosomia. Those big babies who might look strong but are actually metabolically fragile. Jaundice is common but dangerous when bilirubin builds up too fast. The liver's still immature, and if bilirubin crosses into the brain, it can cause permanent damage. Finally, watch for birth injuries like broken clavicles, nerve damage, or head trauma from tough deliveries. Knowing the risk factors early is key. Your skills in spotting these early signs can seriously impact outcomes for these babies and their families. Subscribe to RN Toolkit for more videos like this.